Hey there, YouTube. Um, it's traffic signals training again. Uh, I apologize if I'm yawning, and I also apologize that I'm sitting here. I'm drinking a beautiful cup of espresso because um, I had a rough night. We went on signal calls, didn't get home until late, and then uh, woke up at 4 a.m., and it is now 2.30 in the afternoon. I'm technically off work, but... People keep on popping into my office asking me questions. So, mm, delicious. Okay, people have been asking about lead lag configuration, and I'm just going to give you a, a quick glimpse of what lead lag means. Um, uh, lead lag configuration is basically when a left turn comes up before the other left turn comes up. And so what will happen typically is, um, let's say this is, you know, the side street here. Um, and you have uh, a city center is down here. However, uh, this is like a community, a um, bedroom community for the city, okay? And the freeway, the freeway is this way, right? And there's several ways to get to the city. Maybe the, the freeway's over here. Maybe the freeway on-ramp's over here somewhere or something like that. Anyway, AM peak hours, the demand is very heavy moving in this direction. Cars are coming, going this way, okay? And so, um, but in the PM peak hours, it's the opposite direction. Everybody's going home. Everybody's going back to their neighborhood. So the flow of traffic is a little bit different usually. Um, especially next to a lot of housing communities and stuff like that. And so in order to get cars from point A to point B, you know, you already know a little bit about coordination. Um, the signals will be coordinated together, but you also have this tool called a lead lag configuration. And the idea is, let's say in the AM peak hours, we have the sequence designed so that phase three comes up at the same, same time as phase eight, then phase three will terminate, and then the phase four movement will come up and run at the same time as phase eight. And then while this is going on, eventually phase eight will terminate, phase four is still serving, and then phase seven will come up and run. So this, these guys, this is the lead, okay? Then this is the lag. Then in the PM peak hours, we see that opposite flow in the opposite direction, right? Then we configure so this guy and this guy come up first. And then this guy terminates and then these guys go. And then, then the lagging signal will be phase three, okay? So that's just a, a, a basic once over of what a lead lag configuration is. Um, please hit like, subscribe, and um, as usual, ask me more questions down in the bottom in the comment section, and I'll do my best to try and, um, I don't know, uh, answer them. <laughs> I need more coffee. Cheers. Have a good one.